Welcome back to Decentralized News. So today's story is another adoption news story. Today we're looking at uh, Charles Schwab, which is uh, looking to launch a crypto-themed ETF on the New York Stock Exchange. So Charles Schwab is uh, basically a uh, an American uh, multinational financial service company. Um, they offer banking, uh, commercial investing and uh, services that include uh, consulting and uh, wealth uh, management for both uh, retail and, uh, you know, uh, institutional investors. They're a publicly traded company generating some uh, 18 plus billion dollars um, in 2021, uh, which is uh, the public uh, report that I've got. And, you know, they have a stock price, uh, SCHW, which trades roughly at the moment. It's at about uh, $60 also on the New York Stock Exchange. So this um, big company is now coming to, you know, um, the forefront and uh, saying that uh, they're now looking to uh, offer this uh, crypto ETF. And uh, this is after being uh, sort of, uh, you know, a little bit um, dubious of uh, crypto for so many years. Uh, they did say that they will be now launching their crypto um, thematic index uh, just uh, this coming week. So the fund, which will actually trade on the New York Stock Exchange ACA, um, under the ticker uh, STCE, will now offer indirect exposure to the crypto ecosystem. According to Schwab Asset Management, the investment arm of uh, the Schwab Corporation, and uh, they say, you know, in the prospectus, which uh, the firm filed with the U.S. Securities Exchange Commission on Friday, say, says actually in a bold type that the new fund will not invest in uh, cryptocurrency or digital assets directly so i'm looking to see i think this means that they're probably looking to uh put some uh or buy some stakes in uh, some companies that have uh, uh that are in the cryptocurrency space then they probably like uh, offering uh infrastructure services etc or miners or things like that who knows rather they are saying that uh, about 80 percent of the funds uh, assets uh, will actually be invested in securities, okay, which are shares of uh, companies, like I said, that have a stake in crypto. So the um, prospectus said that the fund has 44% uh, of its assets invested in software companies and another 41% in the diversified financials sector. But again, this just uh, signals uh, that uh, these companies are now starting to really see the future of uh, what uh, blockchain-based uh, companies are doing. So STCE uh, can uh, offer more targeted exposure to cryptocurrency-focused companies compared to blockchain technology ETFs, which may have a significant exposure to multinational companies involved in blockchain, for example, Amazon, IBM, MasterCard, and others. This is according to David Botnet, Schwab's uh, head of equity product management. And uh, the fund will have an actual or annual fund operating expense of 0.30%, uh, which works out to be about uh, $3 per $1,000 invested. That means uh, it will have the lowest uh, crypto cost or cost crypto related ETF available to investors today, according to the company in that announcement. And uh, for comparison's sake, you would look at, uh, for example, the Bitwise Crypto Industry Innovators ETF, BITQ, which charges 0.85%, and Van Eck, uh, which uh, just filed a new spot Bitcoin ETF application, which charges about 0.5%. Uh, percent on its digital transformation ETF or DAP. Um, it's a bid to obviously um, make sure they stay competitive and uh, while also being a bit late to the field so that, you know, maybe there are mistakes to be made. They are not caught up in that. So uh, they have trailed behind other traditional finance competitors like Fidelity, which I have spoken about on this platform multiple times about the moves that they are making. 
So yeah, you know, this is uh, just uh, another story showing you that uh, potentially there's a lot more to come. It's just as far as um, the development of the space and uh, just the maturity of uh, the products and services uh, that you will start to see that are crypto related and potentially new inflows of capital into the space as a result. Let me know what your thoughts are. Again, please check out the links in the description to my books, Tokenized Trillions and Blockchain Applied. If you want to know more about real world asset tokenization on the blockchain and also just the different use cases of these technologies and how they can be applied in uh, uh, different industries. Also go to navigate-digital.com if you want to do business online. I have uh, free resources and tools there for you. Our main site is decentralized.news, best cryptocurrency exchange reviews, DeFi platform reviews, and uh, a whole lot more. Like, share, subscribe, turn on that notification bell. See you in the next video. Peace.